Michael, if you're just joining the chat, we are talking about the best sounding engines of each type of engine. And we on the four cylinder, the four AG out of the A86 with ITBs was the top winner, but also was the AMG two liter turbocharged four cylinder, but also the Fiat 500 Abarth V8s. C63 AMG, so that's a good choice. Man, Michael coming in. The F355, very good choice. Scuffed, I agree. The V8 E39 does sound pretty good. My S65 M3 V8 sounds pretty good as well. But is it the best sounding V8? The best? You think it's the best sounding? Pato, that's a great one. A Mustang Cobra 04 Terminator with a Kenny Bell on it. God, this video is from 16 years ago. This video is 16. This video, if it was a human being, it could have a driver's license. Sounds pretty good. What uh, what else did we have? 426 Hemi. So a few people were saying um, the C63. That's pretty sick. Author, anything, just V8. <laughs> That's sick. Connor, I agree. So Connor says the uh, problem with American V8s is that they don't rev. There's the GT350R, which is a great sounding engine. Is it the best? The best? Mm. new z06 i agree nobody has said the new z06 with the flat plane crank v8 not one person has said that yet all personal opinion but high revving v8 sound better i agree as the person that owns a high revving v8 yeah the hellcats sound good as well it's the same same thing like the terminator cobras the the blower wine but is it the best the best eh, i don't know Bado Gaijin. uh ls I mean, I'm American. I love the sound of an LS. But is it the best sounding V8 ever? Debatable, man. Um, me personally, what I believe is the best sounding V8 is this. Corvette ZR1 sounds great as well. But does it sound better than this? Oh my God, where are they? What is going on in this video? This has to be India, right? This is like India or Pakistan.
Ah, Connor. Connor. Connor, you might be correct. So, uh, it, my personal opinion, there's lots of great sounding uh, V8s out there. Corvette ZR1, uh, GT350R, the Hemi sounded great. So far, my personal opinion, the 458 is the best sounding V8. It even sounds better than cream pie. I know, I know. But a couple people, a couple people uh, have brought this up. The 35, 355. Possibly, maybe. Five five wins. <laughs> Three five five wins the V eight category. Damn. That thing sounds ridiculous, bro. C8Z06. Yeah, so the difference... So here's the thing. The 358, I feel like the 358 has... I mean, the 458 has... It, it's not as high pitch. Oh, man. Man, this is a tough call. Oh, oh, look at this video. Oh, look at this video. Check out my other content because I make actual video. Corvette C8Z06 verse 458 360 CS. Love Ferrari. McLaren 720. Uh, I don't think McLaren because they're turbo. <laughs> This is a tough one. Man, the C eight zero six does sound sick. That wins. WC8, C8, Z06 wins. Everybody saying the C8 beat the 458? I feel like the C8 has more like, uh, the C8Z06 has more like, it has more grunt to it. Does that make sense? It's definitely still a flat plane crank V8. Man, dude, this is a tough one. 
the C8, it, even though it's a flat plane crank V8, it has, you know, it has an extra liter of displacement. So it's a 5.5 instead of a 4.5. So it just has that deeper grunt to it. Ferrari wins. All right, that is a proper, proper noise. Man, the tough one. Damn, dude. This is a tough one, guys. This, yes, author, the C8 sounds beefy. Exactly. That's my exact point. It sounds very beefy. Where the, I mean, you can tell. So here's the thing. What is, does anybody know what's the displacement of the 355? You can tell it. it's a smaller displacement engine than the 458. And then you can tell the 458 is a smaller displacement displacement engine than the C8Z06. Is it 3.5? Is that why it's called a, a 355? But obviously the smaller displacement, the higher rev, the more F1-y, the more exotic it sounds, where, you know, all of them being flat plane crank V8s, the C8Z06 just being a, a, a poor flat plane crank V8, it being pretty large displacement at 5.5 liters. Yeah, it's a 3.5. Okay, 3.5. You have a 3.5, you have a 4.5, and you have a 5.5. And you can tell the distinctive sound differences adding one liter of displacement in each one of those flat plane crank V8s. And I guess it just comes down to your personal ta taste. Do you like the sound of the 3.5 the with extremely high revving, raspy, like super exotic? Or on the other end of the spectrum, the C8 Z06 sounds more, as author put it, beefy. Um, you know, it, it, it has more of that, like, it's just a large displacement engine. And the 458 kind of mix, mixes the two. Uh, we can sit here and talk about this all day. Uh, we're going to have to move on. Uh, we're going to have to move on. First, I have to take a piss. But our next conversation is going to be V10s. and. Uh, somebody in the chat already brought this up. Does anybody have something that is a V10 that is going to beat the LFA? Do you have anything that can beat the LFA? I'm going to go take a piss. Uh, LFA? Are you? Can you? Anything? Think about it. Think. Think hard. Beating the LFA? Anything? <laughs> 